What is the best way to record slow-mo videos? Stay with us and I'll let you know how to do it. All right, guys, I have this question and it's very, very common on my videos. Uh, you guys know I record uh, slow-mo videos when I'm doing some pest control. I like to do that so you guys can get better view of the pellet flying on the air. But there's a few things that you need to know when you're doing the slow-mo. And the very first one is when you're recording the slow-mo, you need a good quality camera or at least a good quality phone that can catch all of that. Uh, the other way that you can do it uh, is just uh, when you're editing your video, uh, slow down the frame per second. But it's still, if you don't have a good quality camera or a good quality phone, it's not going to be the greatest uh, footage. But there are so many things that you can do to record. But let's start with the distance that you're going to be shooting to record slow motion. And let's say you want to shoot right around from 15 to 30 yards. So from 15 to 30 yards, you need a very good quality camera or a very good phone with a good quality because the distance is too short and the frames per second are not going to work the best, you know, in short distance, uh, you know, for a normal camera. And it's, you know, it's, let's say you're shooting 850, 900 feet per second. So the pellet, you know, it just goes super fast down the range or down the target and you won't be uh, able to catch good quality videos out of that. But uh, the other way that you can do that is very simple. How you can do that and make it so simple is lowering the feet per second on your pistol, on your air rifle, or you know, let's say you're shooting bows or whatever. Uh, you gotta lower the feet per second in this case Arrogance, you gotta lower your feet per second to catch the pellet on air with a good quality phone or a good quality camera. Now, there's many cameras out there that you can find on Amazon, eBay, that you can use for a slow mo, but they're gonna cost you a lot of money. They're not that cheap. Uh, it's cheaper to have a, let's say, an iPhone or uh, Android. Uh, updated Android also you know so you can record good quality videos at least you're looking for 4k and pretty much uh, uh, 30 frames per second that's what you're looking for to have to have good quality good quality videos on a slow mo uh, the other and the last that I use is painted palette and if you're looking for a great quality painted palette for doing a slow mo uh, guys I do recommend Andy Gray he's the guy uh, he painted the pellets for you and he's he's doing a great job so please check on him I'm gonna put the links below uh, also his eBay account I'm gonna try to put it right here and see if you can get some pellets from him and the other way that you can do it is when you're stretching your yards let's say instead of shooting at 30 and 35 you're gonna shoot all the way over uh, 80 yards so you can catch a pellet on the air and it's easy that's the methods that I use that's the easy way that I find out how to record uh, a slow -mo. or the other one is shooting a bigger caliber so if you're shooting let's say a 25 or 30 cal you will see the pellet flying down the range because remember uh, 25 uh, let's say 30 call goes slower than normal regular 22 uh, pellets you know but this is the easy way that I try to do all of this this is the easy way that I make my videos but keep in mind if you're gonna lower your feet per second at least make sure you have the right pellet for hunting if you're gonna do hunting you don't hurt the animal and the animal goes away uh, the other thing that I will tell you is make sure, you know, if you're shooting less than 800, less than 500 feet per second, somewhere between 500 and 800, uh, you need to make sure the pellet is heavy enough to kill that animal that you're gonna shoot, okay? So guys, I hope this tip helped you guys. I hope this, uh, I mean, bring something, some new ideas for all of you guys who are asking how to do that, all right? Thank you for watching, guys. 
Hope you guys enjoy and see you in the next one.